I showed you the beginning. It's nothing new. But allow me to continue about the world around you. Humanity at its peak chose it needed more to seek. From knowledge, power, glory, it's all the same story. Because we choose to forget the lessons and mistakes. But it's our lives at stake. So bear with me for humanity's sake. Art and human nature, they do more than just correlate. You see, art flows from within. So who we are carries over in brush or pen. If we want to be a light, we must accept this fact. And it's our pride we must attack. Because it takes courage to look within ourselves and confront what we see. So here, I'll go first. I began to draw when I was five. It was a gift to be alive. To play and create was all I knew. Whatever happened to me and you. I remember the first times I drew it was something not everyone could do. My hands just knew and my mind was free to just create. But as time passed, all I knew was hate. And the world I began to see was like nothing on TV. Isolation was my friend. I needed a helping hand. But reaching out was paralyzing. I couldn't do it. Even though darkness was just as terrorizing. So I did what I always knew. I grabbed a pencil and a pen and I drew what was within. The fear, the hate, the shame. I knew I wasn't the same. The kid who laughed and played was long gone. I pushed everyone away. I only blamed me. So what? A voice said. You don't need them. Believe me, I wasn't insane. But the voice was cunning and somewhat comforting. It knew the perfect words to say. The same voice that let humanity to sin was the voice that stood back with a grin as my life crumbled in sin. It took over me from deep within and my art suffered for it. It felt so easy to quit. I let what was lurking within dictate my art in its direction. I pursued awards and recognition, hoping that success would end my selfish ambition. But one day I stepped back and saw the dismay. This wasn't what I wanted for my life. Someone help me find the way. Here I am, a voice said. Suddenly the atmosphere changed and the darkness dispersed. This voice was different. It brought joy and hope. And in that moment I knew to cling on to the rope. 